Assalamu alaikum dear friends, I am engineer Sepula and you are watching Seval Engineer at Site YouTube channel. So guys, today I am here with a new document which is the most important for QAQC engineer as well as site engineer for all disciplines, civil, mechanical, electrical, whatever are. So what is that document? It's called NCR, Non-Conformance Report. What is NCR? Who will issue it? Who will close it? and what are the detailed form of the NCR I will answer all of these questions in this video so watch this video till the end to get the full information about the NCR guys if you are a new uh, viewer so please subscribe our youtube channel for uh, videos related to quality site videos different technical videos jobs and guidance for fresh engineers so let's start our video what is ncr non conformist report so i will explain in short and words in a one sentence when you execute the work execute do the work against the project specifications against the approved drawings and against the quality requirements it means that you will get non conformance report from the consultant this is called NCR. NCR means executing the work without, uh, against the project specification, against the approved drawings, against the quality requirement, against the international standards. It, so you will get the NCR from the consultant. Who will issue the NCR? Consultant. PMC Project Management Consulting Team. They will issue the NCR to the contractor. And you have to close this NCR or you have to respond to this NCR in 72 hours. In, it's the requirement of our project, so you have to respond to that NCR in 72 hours. And what are the steps to respond to the NCR in 72 hours? For all of these things, let's go to the laptop screen to show the, you the form of NCR and its different steps to close the NCR. So let's move to our laptop screen. So dear friends, this is the non conformance report NCR. So let's see, when you are getting NCR, this format from the consultants. Here will be the consultant logo and here will be the consultant name or their engineering division name like that. Issue date. When you get NCRs, the consultant will put the issue date here. Origin consultant name or your company name, project field, division quality, type of document NCR, discipline and architecture. If you uh, uh, get the NCR for architecture, so it will be discipline and architecture, several for CV, electrical, mechanical, whatever the discipline. Here, number of the NCR, how many NCR you got it, here they will put the number. There will be the ITP number from the uh, for the activity. Here will be the reference number for the work or an activity. Here will be the project name. Here will be the contractor name. Here will be the project manager of the contractor. So now come to the see for a non-conformance detail. Here he will write the detail of non-conformity maybe he will just come for the audit it will be like an inspection or audit mean any audit for the work or it will be like inspection see here he will write the confirm like he can write the contractor cost concrete without inspecting the steel so this is also in NCR the contractor close the shuttering without any without inspection of the form work uh, of the steel whatever is the root cause of the NCR so he will write they will write here after that he will write uh, he will attach some documents like photos drawing WIR MIR and any other attachment he will attach it and he, he will write the NCR reference number so this is the reference number and here he will write NCR reference number here he write a document uh, drawing number like if you are getting NCR for the concrete work without inspecting the steel so he will write the 
drawing number for the steel location of the activity where you get in CR for the location if you get in CR for columns he will write the location of the column and he will here he will write inspection date inspection time originate originator who originate who who is going to issue he will write his name like any engineer from the consultant who will arise the NCR who will issue the NCR he will write his name his designation and date and signature now when he complete this uh, part so he will send it to the client when he send it to the client so the client will review and the client will say accepted rejected like that who will review this he will write his name signature date and approved by the uh, his hire his manager name signature and date here will be the manager name like that after that reviewing by the client the consultant here the consultant will issue in CR the client will review the NCR and approve after that it will come to the contractor contractor witness come part C for the non conformist analysis so the contractor will try to find the root cause of non conformity attach separate sheet if required he will, he will write to check the root cause what why the issue in CR what is the main issue and how it will close when they find the root cause of the basic issue or the basic uh, uh, non conformity after that here they will write their corrective action like in case they will if they uh, concrete they do concreting without informing the consultant and the consultant didn't attend, attend or didn't witness the concrete costing or they didn't see the slump testing and other testing so he will they will write here that we will do the uh, compressive strength for the cylinder after 14 days or after 28 days whatever the action is for the uh, NCR here they will uh, write the root cause of NCR here they will propose their action propose action mean they will here write the solution that how to close that issue how to close the problem when they write in the his uh, proposed remedial action who will propose the action kvk senior from the contractor he will write his name and here he will write the closer date that we tell to which date they will close this issue he will write it here and proposed corrective action this area where is the remedial action and proposed character action past correction attached separate sheet like and to prevent repetition this will be the remedial action to close the solution and here he will as proposed corrective action that in the future he will, they will never repeat these type of uh, actions to avoid NCR so he will they will write like their future plan that we will not do these things again and we will uh, do the correct action and we will do the inspection we will call the consultant engineer on the time of casting like that whatever the correct action they have to write for the future action by the engineer who will write the correct action he will uh, his name will be here inside and as a uh, signature here will be the co contractor project manager uh, name signature and date now part d corrective action approval when the contractor he uh, write their correction uh, corrective action here in this part after that they will submit to the consultant the consultant will will review the corrective action and remedial action if, the, if, if these action are accepted so they will click on accept or if this is not accepted and they will review the corrective action and they have some comments so they will write here comply with comments revise resubmit like if they have any objection so they will write their objection here and they will say comply with comment and resubmit it who will check the NCR and the consultant his name will be here signature date who will verify from the consultant side the corrective action his name will be here and signature NCR closer if the corrective action is accepted then this is the part for the verification of work verification of work who will verify the work the consultant will will verify the work and they will come for the inspection of the corrective action and they will check like a test report whatever or the corrective action they will say corrective work done and found acceptable if further correct uh, corrective work is required so they will write here and you have to do that in CR and they will say in CR close no 
if they click here so they will say no if no then you have to do the correct action again and you have to complete as per the requirement but if the correction corrective work done and it is found acceptable so they will click in here and they will mark it here yes and verify name and signature so your ncr will be closed uh, there will be the attachment if you have any pictures whatever they so they have to attach here this sheet for the root analysis and for both remedial action like in case this area see like this area is small like three lines if you were uh, corrective action or proposed remedial action is more so you have to you have here the separate phase you have, you can write it here so there are division different departments and like that so guys this was the ncr report or non conformance report maybe different project have the different format but the procedure to closing it issuing it reviewing it corrective action everything is same so if you have any issue related this documents you can comment your question in the comment box and i will try to answer that there thank you so much for watching video